Baby. Oh, sugar, look at that. Red thing, congratulations. I passed the grade three. Yay. Woohoo. <laughs> so, looks like an evil Dave without sunglasses. Just saying. Hey, guys, how's it going? Oh, my God. It's got all foggy and stuff in here. What just happened there? Hey, guys. Hey, Big Box Dave here from Magic the Gathering Attitude. Um, so, I'm going to do something uh, very special. Uh, that I, I wanted two things to be complete. I wanted to, we, I should say, we wanted to hit a thousand subs and set up a Patreon. And also, I wanted to pass my test before I did this. So, uh, let's pull out ye old box. Uh, <laughs> has, has ye old stuff in it, you know. <laughs> so, you got some uh, samplers here. It was a 7th edition sampler or something like that. 5th edition, and there it is right there. There it is right there. This pack would probably grade it about an 8 or 8.5, and it is uh, it is definitely sealed. And uh, I am going to open this up. That's going to happen. I'm going to open up a $900 Legends booster pack. And um, from what I understand, it goes uncommon, 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 rare. So um, we're going to open this up together. And I will show you guys. Where, where the heck is this? I should have. I probably should have inspected this and done a little, little pre-combat check, so to speak. So let's pull that out of there. Okay. It's a nice little backpack holder, actually. Okay. So this is obviously the juice you can pull out of here. So it's all right there. You know, from Tabernacles to Pendrel Veil, Moat. It's a great card. Chains of Mistopheles. The Abyss, Nether Void, Eureka, All Hallows Eve, one of my favorite cards of all time. It just goes on and on and on. I mean, you got uncommons in there too that are that are well worth over two hundred dollars. So the majority are rare. Uh, the only common card that's over uh, ten dollars is Darkness. So, and I, I looked it up before we went in there, but we're gonna open these up one at a time, and I'm gonna price them as we go. So. Um, are we going to get our $900 back? If I hit one of these cards, sure. But uh, other than that, yeah, this is this is a big deal. This is a big deal. So I was going to open this anyway, but I just wanted to share it with you guys. So, oh my God, that pack just opened right up. Did you guys see that? Okay, that pack opened right up. Okay, I don't like that that happened. I have not touched this pack. Hmm. I don't like that. I just want to see if there's any glue on there or anything. I'm glad I did this on camera. So, um, because I paid a hefty amount for this card. There is the, uh, the rules card right there. So, all right, let's see here. And this should be, okay. So that should be uncommon right there on the front. So I will flip it. There's the rules card right there. So this should be uncommon, 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 fourth, un I believe there's four uncommons in each, and then the rare in the back. I'm just looking to see if there's any signs of wear. I mean, that looks that looks pretty normal right there. That looks pretty normal. So, I mean, you can, they can get a little worn and whatnot inside the pack, but okay, let's uh, let's just go through the back of these real quick. If you guys can see anything where, you know, and, and again, the, the camera accentuates things like big time. But this was, I think, kind of normal for the times. So, but it doesn't look like there's any play on here. But the, I don't like how that pack was opened up. I don't like that at all. I don't like that at all. And uh, I did buy this from a, uh, from a seller. Okay, let's go to the first one. All right, here we go. Okay, Wall of Vapor. I'm just going to put it down. Yeah. So let's check out Wall of Vapor. Vapor. Wall of Vapor. And give me one second here. And again, this is going to be a little bit long because I'm just checking out um, all the prices as we go. Okay, Wall of Vapor. 51 cents. That's TCG market price. There you go. Okay, we'll put Wall of Vapor off to the side. Okay, Lost Soul. Beautiful art. Look at that. Okay, let's check Lost Soul. 
<laughs> you guys are like, man, this is boring. All right, Lost Soul, whopping 72 cents. <laughs> All right, so we're up to a buck something. Giant turtle, look at that. Yeah, <laughs> love it. All right, so we'll check Giant Turtle. All right. And again, yeah, 42 cents. And you got to get a lot of that. See that, that, you see that right there? That is what concerns me right there. And that is the rare card. I open that pack very gingerly. And if this is a repack, I am going to be 100% pissed off. Okay, Enchanted Bean. Let's check it out. Right, and she had to be in whopping 88 cents. There you have it. All right, here we go. Anti magic aura. Hmm. Again, I should just probably go through those pretty quick. What was it? Anti magic aura? Oh, okay. Magic aura. Okay, a buck, too. There we go. Our first car, our first car that's a dollar or more. There we go. Sorry, only 800 more to go. Vampire Bats, love that art. Love that art. So, Vampire Bats should be up there a little bit. Should be about a buck or two, I'm assuming. Nope, not even. 68 cents. Woohoo! All right. Moving on up in the real world. Ugh, immolation. Oh, my God. Oh, God, the artwork on this. Love it. Immolation. Okay, $1.23. Thought that would be up there a little bit. Okay, there we go. And, okay, Hornet Cobra. Oh, somebody's calling in. I have to decline that. Okay, Hornet Cobra. We'll check that one out. Uh, Hornet Cobra might be up there a little bit because it does have first strike. So, Hornet Cobra, 41 cents. Man, kind of whiffing on the commons. Nice if Darkness came out. Jeez, man, how do you even. <laughs> Enchantment Alteration. Okay. Never even heard of that card. It's definitely not worth anything. <laughs> Enchantment. All right, let's see. Uh, Ninety-four cents. Okay. All righty. Let's go to the next. All right. Ooh, Tundra Wolves. Oh, beautiful. You worth a little bit. Tundra. Oh shoot! I didn't mean to show you that, guys. Sorry about that. Tundra Wolves, 82 cents. Okay. Well, we already kind of saw this one. So, by the way, this set is 29 years old. Okay, Voodoo Doll. Just pulling it right back up so you guys can see it. There it is right there, Voodoo Doll. Let's check out Voodoo Doll. See what it is. See what it be. Voodoo Doll. Wow, Voodoo Doll, 1677. Okay. It's a bit of a banger. All right. And let's go to the next one. Okay. Oh, sh I love this. I love the artwork on this card. I know it's not worth a lot. But Shimmy and Night Stalker. Look at that. That one is gorgeous. It is gorgeous. Oh, it's a white card behind there. Okay. So, Shimmy and Night Stalker. Yeah, 354. 354. All right. Here we go. What do we got next? All right. Great Wall. Wow. Great Wall. I don't, I've never even heard of that card, to be honest with you guys. Great Wall. That's worth a whopping 361 And I just, again, I, ooh, ooh, I, ooh, ooh, I'm not trying to show, I'm not trying to show it. I just, hey, actually, you know what? Well, hmm, leave that right there for a second. I just, I don't want to bend the cards or anything. So, and if it's a repack, oh, I'm going to be pissed. And I'll let you know it's a repack. Some of these did open up easy. I do remember that back in the day. But, but, it's always suspect when you spend that kind of money on a card. So, there it is right there. Great wall, guys. All right. Oh, let's put Shimmy and Stalker there. Because that's not common. Okay, here we go. Who we got? Backfire. Oh, wow. I have heard of this card. I have heard of that card. All right, I'm going to put it right on top of that right there. Okay, Backfire. 
to check the price. Backfire, five bucks. Five bucks. Okay, so that should be our final uncommon. That should be our final uncommon. Just uh, yep, just picking it up. Okay, so now this is this is what concerned me right there. See that? That's on the rare. That right there. Why is it on the just on the rare? Keepers of the faith. Hmm. Is that even a rare? No, it's a freaking common. Pause for the cause while I try to figure this one out. All right, and we're back. Okay, so Voodoo Doll was actually the rare. So maybe this was a legit pack. Maybe this was a legit pack. And this one would be somewhere in the... Uh, the Keepers of the Faith would be somewhere in the middle. So... There you have it. So Voodoo Doll is the is the winner, and uh, that's my big one, my uh, sixteen dollar nine hundred dollar pack. <laughs> so there you go. It looks, I mean, it it does look legit. It does look legit, but you always get suspect with this stuff, and you know, it's it's a huge it's a huge gamble. It's like buying a thousand dollar scratch ticket and getting nothing in return, and that's what this ended up being. So uh, hey guys, hey, uh, thanks for sharing this with me. Um, you guys be the judge on whether it's a repack or not, and let me know, and I'll see you all in the comments. Voodoo love. Much love to you guys. Hey, thanks, hey, thanks for everything, guys. I appreciate all your love and support every day. Deuces.